Hello, good morning, Bokertov. We start our day two, of course, with breakfast. The restaurant is in the hotel, the same restaurant with yesterday dinner, by the way. This morning will be long, long trip. So, let's make our belly full. We laugh out loud because good morning in Hebrew language, Bokertov, means poop, boker, in Indonesian language. It's so funny. Yeah, we start our day by singing, worshipping, praising our Lord, and of course praying too. Remember, this is not only traveling but also pilgrimage. So this journey has also given us a spiritual journey for our soul. We are in Israel Tiberias area, which is surrounded by the beautiful view of Sea of Galilee. Actually, it's not a sea, but a very very big lake. In Indonesian language Bible, we also used lake to call it and not the sea. All right, first destination is the primate of St. Peter Church. This is a place where Jesus appeared himself to the disciples after his resurrection. John chapter 21 verse 1 until 7 says, Afterward, Jesus appeared again to his disciples by the Sea of Galilee. We also have our first sermon there. Also, our pastor preached the word that practicable. So first of all, we touched the water of the Sea of Galilee just to fill it. This is the lake, the place where Jesus was here when he came to this world. And to keep remembering it, here also built the primate St. Peter Church. Okay, next, our second destination to visit is Capernaum, the town where the Lord Jesus performed the most miracles, such as cast out many evil spirits, raise the daughter of Jairus from dead, killed mother-in-law of Simon Peter and delivered the bread of life sermon in a synagogue of Capernaum. But today's Capernaum only become a national park. Why? It's because Jesus has cursed this town so that everything that people try to build back in this town has failed. This is the local guide himself told us that the people have worked for it but failed and useless so um, we can read our bible in luke chapter 10 verse 13 until 16 and here is the house of simon peter still we love to enjoy and take some documentaries of the view it's so beautiful sea of galilee and then back to the bus, say bye to Capernaum. The third spot to visit today is Topga. Yes, Topga is the place where Jesus performed the very, very famous miracle of five loaves and two fish. Please read the passage in Matthew chapter 14, verse 13 until 21. Inside, there is a church where we can pray there, but as you can see, the church is under maintaining. There is one person at repairing the floor, and as we can see, the ceramics are very, very tiny. So yes, it is need a lot of work. The fourth visit point is the Beatitudes Hill, 
Of course, there is a church upside. And this hill is the place where Jesus preached about the Beatitudes. I'm sure this is also the famous verses in Bible. Please read Matthew chapter 5 verse 1 until 12. Brothers and sisters, you are blessed even in hard times because you will receive eternity in heaven. In Jesus' name, Amen. Okay, before we continue the visiting, it's our time to have lunch. Yep, we have Simon Peter's fish for today's lunch. Oh, it is nice and tasty. Really, I really like it and I want more. Don't forget the fresh dates also yummy. Enjoy! Next destination, our fifth visit spot today is having happy cruising time on the Sea of Galilee. And things we do are sing worship songs, short sermon by our pastor, waving our country flag by singing the national anthem Indonesia Raya and dancing together. Free dancing time. We have so much fun when cruising on board. Thank you for the memories. And gratefully, we come to the last visit point today, which is also our sixth destination. Yardinet, Jordan River, baptismal site. The place where Jesus Christ were baptized by John the Baptist. I have baptized on December 16, 2018, and in this site, I rededication on July 18, 2023. This experience is very valuable and powerful for me. I feel so blessed and deeply reminded, knowing that I myself have decided to follow Lord Jesus with all my heart, my strength my soul, and my mind to live this life by faith in Jesus Christ that I believe He is the Messiah, my Lord Savior. He came to this world to save and free me from all my sins. He has died on the cross and rose on the third day and also has ascended into heaven and sat on a throne. And I trust that He will come back a second time to pick me 
to pick us, to pick everyone up. For we who believe in Him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Amen. In this baptism moment, Holy Spirit has touched my heart again and renewed my soul. And after that, we're heading back to the hotel, dinner, and enjoying the view. Again, I will never get enough for the view. And yeah, we have ended our day two journey in Israel. And tomorrow morning, we'll check out from this hotel and go to the other city. So, see you tomorrow. Hi there, this is my honor to share our Israel journey with you. I hope you all enjoy this video. Please give us thumbs up and share if you blessed by it. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Thank you, see you next time and God bless you.